guys welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here my name is Anna and today I have a new sellers haul for you guys so you guys I am actually super excited about this haul so a lot of these items I've gotten kind of over the past few months and I know a lot of you guys really liked the last raw live sale that I did so with a lot more like raw and rough crystals you guys really love those so I did promise you guys that I was going to be bringing in some more rough and raw crystals and finally I did get enough to fill out a whole table and you guys I am super super excited so as I mentioned before if you did see the previous haul that I did with a lot of raw and rough crystals it's one of those things that after you've collected spheres towers palm stones carvings and things Things like that you really start gaining an appreciation for raw and rough specimens don't get me wrong there's nothing wrong with spheres towers and carvings but sometimes it's really interesting to see crystals in their raw form and I personally really love to collect them as well again it's not for everyone right everyone has their taste like if you're someone that just prefers the more polished up tower spheres I totally understand but I know a lot of you guys did ask me for more raw and rough crystals so I finally was able to get some more in so let's get started with the sellers haul because I am so excited to show you guys what I have out on the table so as you guys can tell, a lot of these items I have kind of in bulk, so I have a really good amount of them. And a lot of rough and raw materials are a lot cheaper than like fully polished items or carvings. So that's another thing. A lot of the items on this table will be at really good prices, but I do also have some high quality pieces as well. So there kind of will be a little bit of mix of everything. Definitely a lot more on affordable side, but there also will be some more higher priced, high quality items. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys is what I have over in these bowls So I was able to get some gorgeous Peruvian pink opals Now I haven't had pink opals in the shop for almost two years now Because it's been so hard for me to try to source and find But I was finally able to get some more in And you guys how absolutely stunning are these They're gorgeous polished but they're also super super gorgeous raw Like look at how stunning these pieces are and again pink washes out on camera and do you guys see how gorgeous that baby pink color is in these so i do have some rough specimens that again a lot of different sizes i have some small medium larges and then i also was able to get my hands on some fully polished palm stones as well so these are fully polished and you guys just look at this quality and again can we just talk about how gorgeously saturated these are as i mentioned pink does wash out but these do not wash out at all they are such beautiful quality so i was able to get them in tumbles but let me know if you guys would be interested in more of the pink opals like possibly flames top polish towers that has just been really hard for me to source recently for some reason so when i finally saw my supplier had some i kind of just grabbed what they had because i really really love pink opals they're really really beautiful and again that is peruvian pink opals also here on this side you see a lot of purples kind of scattered throughout i was able to get my hands on these gorgeous high quality kunzite pieces so these are i would just say uh, kind of like free forms in a way. I guess they're like little free forms, but really nice high quality pieces. So I did get some variety of again mediums. This is one of like the largest pieces that I have. And you guys, the luster in these is so insane. These are so gorgeous. I've had kunzite in the shop before and I've had high quality, like fully polished pieces, but these raw pieces. You guys, I mean, the luster in them is insane and they are all natural. How gorgeous are these? So I do have a ton of them. I have kind of more thicker ones. I do have more smaller, skinnier ones. And again, I will have them in all different sizes, but this is high quality kunzite. So these will be on the more pricier side, but they are so, so stunning. Definitely a collector's piece. A lot of the bigger pieces will be. They will be priced as such, but honestly, such an investment, especially if you are someone that loves Kunzite or you've been looking for a higher quality piece, those will be out on the table. And then also towards 
the front. It's kind of hard to see because I know it's kind of washing out and blending in with the table, but I actually was able to get you guys some Perkamores. So Perkamores are actually very similar to Herkimore quartz that are found in New York. These are just found in Pakistan, but they are just as amazing quality as Herkimores are that are found in New York. To me, I would say they mostly resemble like diamonds, like the luster in them and how gorgeous type of clarity that you get in Herkimores. That is the same quality of these beautiful Herkimores. But again, they are, a lot of them are half rough, half polished up. So these will be at really great prices. So if you are someone that loves Herkimer or if you've always wanted some Herkimer diamonds, kind of again, the same thing, but these are just found in Pakistan. I honestly cannot rave about these enough. They are super, super gorgeous. And again, not something super common. You don't really see a lot of people getting Perkamores because of course a lot of folks want to get Perkamore diamonds. Um, I am trying to source those as well. I've had smaller ones in the shop before, but I am trying to find bigger ones. But these are very similar, pretty much almost identical to those. So if you were looking for Herkimers before, or if you've never heard of Perkamores and wanted to add them to your collection, that's also an option. But look at how absolutely stunning they are. So a lot of them will be either kind of like this medium size or smaller. I would say this is probably my biggest piece. It's kind of like the chunkiest, largest piece that I have. But even Herkimer diamonds are on the smaller side. The really, really big pieces go for probably thousands of dollars, to be honest with you guys. So these smaller pieces are really nice and super affordable. And then also as we go up, you see a lot of these gorgeous smokies. So this kind of middle row and this back row are all really gorgeous Alestio quartz. So I actually didn't realize just how many quartz pieces that I got until I set up the table for this gorgeous rough slash raw live sale. And I realized just how much quartz pieces I ended up getting. But you guys, look at how absolutely stunning these are. So a lot of them will be on the smoky side. And then I do have some clear ones. And then I also have a few that have some gorgeous brown inclusions in them. So again, there really will be nice options. And these are Alestio quartz. You can find, I honestly have found a ton of different rainbows in these a lot of fun inclusions i found like black tourmaline i found some golden healer so really really gorgeous variety and these alestials but i just love to see i mean you guys look at how gorgeous these are i promise you the camera is not doing it any justice i love to just see the layering of each crystal on top of one another I think it is just so, so beautiful. And these are super amazing crystal for manifesting. As always, I will add a little snippet of what the metaphysical properties of each crystals are. And you guys, Alestials are absolutely amazing. And of course they are, I personally think a trillion times better in person. Again, these layers, I am absolutely obsessed. So a lot of these will be on the more smokier side, but I also do have some with some gorgeous, almost like orange undertones, like these yellow orange tones in them. And it's taking even the camera like a second to focus, but look at how stunning this quality is. Oh. You guys, I am absolutely obsessed. So again, there will be kind of smaller options, some larger options, and then some really big options. So you will have a really good variety. And then kind of going backwards on this little dish, I have some higher quality items as well as some really gorgeous colorful items. So the first thing I did end up getting are these gorgeous pink aragonite kind of rough clusters. So they are not really polished. They're not fully polished. They're just kind of cleaned up a little bit. A lot of them do have their matrix and just a really gorgeous like saturated pink color on these. I just really love the different coloring of them. So I did get quite a few of them. But look at how beautiful they are. I'm just, I'm honestly really obsessed. I also really love them next to the aquamarines. So I did get some higher quality aquamarine pieces as you guys will see. So this is, it's fairly polished, but it's still fairly rough. But look at how gorgeous this quality is. So I did get two with just aquamarine in it. And then I do have a couple in Matrix. So some of them do have muscovite. Some of them have some black tourmaline inclusions. But you guys look at how absolutely stunning these clusters are. I am honestly so obsessed. And the way the blue just plays off the Matrix. Oh 
my goodness it honestly just reminds me of like the ocean and calming waters and I also do have some smaller pieces as well. So again, a really good variety. I do have some large pieces. I have some smaller pieces. So honestly, if you're someone who is looking for raw crystals, this is definitely the live sale to join because I did get such a nice variety. I also did get some gorgeous fatten quartz. And they are just another variety of quartz, again, that comes from Pakistan and the Middle East. And it's just, again, the luster, the clarity on these are so gorgeous. So I do have one bigger, and then I do have some smaller options as well. So they do, they're honestly almost resemblance of these Perkamores. But again, just another variety of quartz that I'm absolutely obsessed with. I hope that some of these items that I am showing are new to you guys, because a lot of them were new to me when I was able to get them from my supplier. And then I also do have some Epido, and you guys, look at how sparkly these epidotes are they are so stunning so i have just a few clusters not too many about five of them but they are so gorgeous so they are i would say like half polished half raw like they weren't fully polished down but they are really beautiful specimens again i just really appreciate kind of like the colors in this there's so many different colors which i'm absolutely obsessed with and as we make our way over on the right side i do have some more of these gorgeous kunzite pieces again some really nice statement pieces you guys the quality on these kunzites are insane and if you do purchase them they will come with the little stand and the little museum putty so you can display them like this just so you guys are aware obviously i will take them off the stand and wrap them up in a careful way but they will come with the stands and the museum putty and you could just put them on there and display them as is as i have displayed them for the live sale and then the last thing that i have out on the table which are super affordable and such gorgeous pieces are these multi-color lapidolites you guys I know it's kind of hard to tell because I feel like the flash is kind of washed out a little bit. It's kind of washing out the colors, but a lot of the middles are this yellow lapidolite and then all around is purple lapidolite. I even kind of dimmed the lights down, but I know it's kind of hard to tell because it is so flashy, but how gorgeous are these? And also you will see they are kind of flaky, like you will see kind of pieces flake off that's just how natural lapidolite is so definitely handle these with care you don't want to be too rough with them because again they will kind of flake off let me see if i can show you a better piece oh there we go this one you can really see it so they have all yellow in the middle and then around it purple but how gorgeous are these and then as you can see on the side there are just a lot of gorgeous layers in here and this is called multicolor lapidolite and these are on the raw side but how gorgeous are these i actually got this from my supplier in brazil they are honestly absolutely stunning i've actually been waiting a while to premiere them and again as i mentioned they are on the affordable side i know they look expensive but they are on the pretty affordable side so that is all that i have for this week's sellers haul i really really hope you guys can join me i know a lot of you guys really love the raw and rough crystals so i really hope you guys can join i hope you enjoyed this sneak peek if you are new to my channel i do a live sale two hours after this video posts over on my instagram which is anna's crystal shop so if you are available definitely join in and if you are someone that regularly joins you definitely don't want to miss this one because this is going to be a good one and i will see you guys in my next seller's haul bye guys